Hey everybody, this is the last on GameCube, and welcome back to more Sonic Unleashed Blind. In the last episode, I missed something totally obvious, and it took me ten minutes to find it. And in this episode, I'm going to... I'm going to do something else. Anyways, while we're, I'm doing these gameplay things... First temple, Gaia Gate. Huh. Uh, I think I have something new to do in this area. Could be wrong. What? Okay, what do I have to do in this area? Because last episode, I definitely remember we had something to do in this area. Okay. Or am I completely wrong about this? Er. There's no knob on this door. Let's look around and see if there's some kind of switch. Okay. Wait, no knob. Okay, so I can go here. And... Ha! That was actually kind of funny. See, I'm not a total idiot. Destroy the plants! I'm a horrible plant killer! Okay, no, not really. My mom's a gardener when she was alive. Anyways, I'm just gonna try to do what I can. Anyways... Eh? Die! Jeez. Anyways, yeah. What was I gonna say? Oh, yeah! A lot of people told me that the Werehog is actually the mo one of the worst mechanics in the Sonic series. I don't think it's the worst. However, the one thing that I don't like about the Werehog is the fact that you actually move really slow. The only thing I wish was improved with the Werehog is that it kept moving really fast, like Sonic always does. Other than that, I like the I actually like the Werehog mechanic. It suits him perfectly. Like, like Eggman said, it's actually a very festive book. I actually agree with him on that one. Anyways, kill these. These aren't idiots, actually. They know what to do. Buddy! Buddy! Over here! There. Jeez. Anyways, yeah. So, yeah, what are you guys up to? I got Kirby Squeak Squad a couple days ago. Uh, I was, like, totally bored. So bored that... Sonic, I, I got to you dashed here, you'd be able to jump this dis... I didn't know that! Anyways, I'm going to assume that it was instant death right there. Oh, wait. Anyways, as what as I was saying, I got so bored on Sunday that I actually watched TV for the first time in four months. Yeah, how ironic of me. Imagine me actually watching TV again. Well, then again, since I ever since I had my Let's Plays, I've never watched TV ever. I'm not kidding. I watched. I used to watch a lot of TV in the past, actually. It's kind of funny that I don't watch TV anymore. Anyways, can I go up these? Yes, I can. I'm not sure if I want to do that just yet. Anyways, what's over here? What's over here? Oh, what is that? Oh yeah, you can't boost in here. Duh. I don't know why I said duh, because I didn't even know that in the first place. Over. Anyways, you do are supposed to go up here now. Over here. Oh, okay. I'm pressing the X button, but it's not opening. Oh, I don't. What was it? Uh, what's that in? Okay. I don't know, honestly. Oh, I get what it's supposed to do. Oh, it's actually kind of a cool mechanic, if I do say so myself. Jeez. Anyway. Anyways, I can't go over there. I. I think you can move sideways here. You think? Is it as if it's not meant to look like you can? As if it's meant to look like you can't move sideways. 
enemies. For a second, I thought that was an enemy, enemy zone. And of course, you can't crouch. You can't crouch in this game. And again, I don't think you can crouch in many Sonic games. Wow, you don't even have to charge it up yourself. It charges it up for you. That's actually a nice mechanic. I like this mechanic already. And again, what mechanics do I not like at all? Jeez. Imagine me not liking a mechanic about any mechanics about video games. Anyways, what's in here? Oh, another secret. Anyways, yeah. As I was saying, what do you guys have to do? I bet. I've gotten Kirby's Squeak Squad a couple days ago, and... I got Kirby's Squeak Squad a couple days ago, and yeah. Just today, actually, I went to see my friend's house, and I just... And she told me that my friend... My friend told me that she was going to be in a movie, and... Am I, supp am I supposed to ring this bell or not? Apparently not. Yeah, anyways, my friend was actually in a movie. It's not a movie that's going to be in theaters everywhere. It's just a special movie that she did with her friends, just because of the major that she's in. But yeah, anyways, she... She just showed it to me if I... To be honest, I was supposed to have her over to my house today, but because she had a busy schedule and she's going back to college next week, she... I don't want to. She really wanted to come to my house, but she couldn't. And enemies, great. Anyways, yeah, she wanted to come over to my... She wanted to come over to my house. To, I was going to invite her over to play pool. I've been over to her house, and she hasn't been over to my house. I ironic that she's never been over to my house because she used to live... In, on my street 10 years ago. Oh, whatever. Anyways, enough about that. Let's just... Get, get, get. Hammer time! <laughs> anyway, even though I didn't even do anything. Anyways, enough about her. Enough about my friend. Enough giving shots to anybody. That's not what I do here. I, I'm here to play video games and have fun with it. Anyways, just today, I... I actually got a copy of Twilight Princess for Christmas, but... It was an unopened copy of the Wii version. However, I already have a copy of Twilight Princess. Yeah, I already had a copy of Twilight Princess, and I didn't want to send it back. Not spoiling why I said Wii version, even though I probably already said it. Then I should not have said it. Anyways. Oh, crap. I only have three minutes left to do this. Screw the secret over there. That's why I actually have to go there. And I see a lever. Let's see what it and oh, you're supposed to press. It. I'm just holding X down for this. And there's more enemies. Hooray! Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! That's why I wanted to do. Ah, wow, hammer's actually powerful if you know how to use it. Which unfortunately I do not know how to use it. Hammer! Hammer! That uh, felt like referencing it in Vader Sim today! Look, after referencing like Raptor Specs few videos back in Mario 64. Actually referencing Chuggo. Not Raptor Specs. Why did I confuse Chuggo with Raptor Specs? Jeez. Then again, neither of them work well with others. Can I please kill these guys? Can I kill these guys? I only have two minutes left. Can I hit them? Can I just hit them? Anyways, I'm betting this is where I have to go. Where's the goal ring? Am I supposed to go over here? No, I'm not. I don't even know what the hell I'm doing right now. And... 
this one nice and slow. You don't want to slip and No kidding. I won't. I almost died. Okay, so I only have a minute left. Oh, there's the goal ring. Wow, it took me nine minutes and ten seconds to get to a certain goal ring. Uh, can I, start over? I wish I could, but I can't. A B? A B? On a level that took ten, nearly ten minutes? What? Power Dark Guy's power gathers around Sonic. Sonic can now chain together more attack. That dark guy was a villain. Wait. Where? A new mission has been added. Heart. Head to the moon door at the Atlas Gaia Gate. Continue playing? Yes. Only on 11 minutes. Anyways, what I was about to say is that it got me a copy. My cousin in law got me a copy of Twilight Princess, but I already have uh, that game. And. Oh, nice. I don't even have to do that now. Anyways, I already have a copy of that game, and... Yeah. I already have a copy of that game, and I don't even... And... What I really wanted was Kirby's 20th Anniversary Dream Collection, and what do you know? It actually came in the mail today. I actually forgot all about it, in fact. And... Can I just take a... Can I just see the enemies, please? Game. I think you're gonna have to use the Werehog for a lot in this game. Uh, it doesn't bother me too much, even though it bothers most people, because almost ever a lot of people actually hate the Werewolf, the Werehog. I don't know why, it's just imperfectly, except for not being able to move very fast like he's supposed to be. Die already. Okay, there we go. Anyways, yeah, I got. I actually got a copy. Of Another ring. Think you could break this wall with a punch, Sonic? That's what I was actually going to try doing. That's actually what I was going to try doing. And but doesn't contain any of the rings. What? Oh, great. Oh, here's one of them. Anyways, got that. Anyways, I got, ended up getting Kirby's 20th Anniversary Union Collection in the mail. I almost I almost forgot all about it, in fact. And can I please punch? Can I punch this door? Jeez. At, for a second, I already thought I couldn't go through it. Oh, secret. Oh, it's not really worth it too much. I'm not here to get 100% this time. This is my first block. Come on. And again, I have to ask, why is everybody criticizing me of my bad gameplay? It's my first blind let's play. Give me a break. Anyways, what's over here? Nothing. What? And of course I go through those pots that do absolutely nothing. Anyways, yeah. Let me go through here. And of course I should have known there would be enemies here. And I actually hate these enemies because I almost can't even hit them. Well, so much for hating them because I already killed them in less than 10 seconds. One of them in less than 10 seconds. Come on, you have a slip. I really do not like the camera in, the, in certain parts of this game. Uh, can I... Screw it. Jeez, I was pressing the B button. This is not B is not attack like he, it should be in most games. All the R is attack. Jeez. Anyways, what's in here? More enemies? Ah! Really? Oh. So much for I hate. I just seriously hate this area. And is that a secret? What? Oh, 
Okay. I don't think, I, don't, I seriously do not know why I went there, because I think, yeah, you're supposed to go over here. And of course, there's more enemies as soon as I get over here. Yeah, remember, I'm not the best Sonic Let's player, even though Sonic the Hedgehog 1 has made, has actually improved my motor skills a lot. Trust me, for a 16-bit game, the Sonic 1 actually has an impressive sound, quite an impressive soundtrack. And... Is there anything else in here? Nothing! Screw it, just run. Night. And I bet there's gonna be more enemies in here if I do it. Or not. Huh. And there's the ring up. How much you bet I'm gonna run into enemies if I go in here, through here? I bet I will. And of course, I jinx myself. And I jinxed it to a positive effect instead of a negative one. And pro no, watch, I said that I'd probably jinx that, too. Let me see, I got 20, Kirby Swain. Of course I had to open my big fat mouth! <laughs> okay, I'll admit, that's, that was actually pretty fast. I don't know why they put rings in here, because it doesn't look like you keep track of rings in The second thing I thought I was in the middle of those guys. God, come on! Oh, so you have to run in order to stun them. I don't know why I was right. Oh, yeah, you do have to run in order to stun them. And two. How did that guy... How did this guy get stunned and the other guy did not? Oh, this guy has more HP. That's just great. I don't know why they give you rings, because it doesn't look like they keep track of your rings in here. Anyways. I have no idea where we are, but this actually looks kind of soothing. Of course the gold ring appears when I have no idea where the heck I am. Oh, whatever. There we go. At least you didn't say, did I start over? Nice view there at of his ass. And, oh, we got an A. Two moon medals. Ah, I'm not even interested in these medals. Is, do I get anything here? No, I do not. Contained a tablet fragment, joined with a blue jewel. Huh. Wonder what's happening now. Oh! Cutscene. I'm going to assume this is a boss fight, even though I've already... As you know, I've already seen all the cutscenes. I just haven't seen a video of the gameplay at all. And... Hey, Tails. Wow, you're by doing absolutely nothing. What are you doing out here? Sonic, is that really you? That's a new look. What happened? You know me. Never a dull moment. That's for sure. Chocolate? <laughs> uh, thanks. I got he accepts it when he doesn't even take it out of his hand. Some story. I'll bet that means that you turning into that and the planet breaking apart are somehow related. I need to find Eggman and make him fix this <laughs> and fast. About that, I think I know someone who might know something about what's going on here. Oh, really? Professor Pingle over at Spagonia University <laughs> is in this city to gather some data. If we add that to his research findings, we might be able to get to the bottom of all this. 
Scobia. That's a continent over. An easy jog if the planet weren't broken. No problem. My tornado one will get us there in a flash. Let's get going. As always, he always has you, Tails. Let's get moving. When Sonic can't run, Tails can always fly. Let me like it. Even though it's kind of obvious. I like how Chip just d did a mid-air backstroke. <laughs> then again, that's that's not the funniest that Chip is, of course. And I like how there are two tails on the as a logo on that plane. It's kind of funny. World map. And it can now be selected. Oh, there's a new world? Aptos new... Oh! It's begun again. Oh, it's new here. Next destination. Ah, uh, going back here. What's this? Stage. Oh, wait. Well, apparently I had no boss fight whatsoever. I'm gonna go to the village. <laughs> I think I'll just boom one second. Baker Street. Do I know Professor Pickle? I did hear stories of the famous professor living in the area, but that's all I know. <gasps> what? Main Street. Hmm, you're looking for some laboratory? Gee, I haven't got a clue. Does my sister know you yes. She's my friend, not my sister. <laughs> laboratory, what? Sorry, I can't help you. I'm right in the middle of things. I'm sorry. Oh, the lab. You're looking for the professor. He's vanished in thin air. He's vanished in the thin air. Oh my god. He has evaporated like a ninja. I'm kidding. He is a ninja. I'm kidding. <laughs> I don't know where I was going with that. I'm having a hard time finding him myself. I should explain first. I'll direct you to the lab. Please go on ahead. That. Uh, game! Can I just go? God. Why does Tails look so shocked? <laughs> this is the place, Sonic Professor Pickles Laboratory. This is the guy that he vanished. Let's go in there and see if he's there. What? Professor Pickles been kidnapped? I thought you said he's vanished in the thin air. Before the tremors hit, this old man showed up with a. and a. and a whole pack of robots. They carried poor Professor Pickle off, lab data and all. It can't be. That sure sounds like Eggman. What a horrible thing to do. We've got to go help that professor guy out, and fast. If he got kidnapped that long ago, he's got to be real hungry by now. <laughs> this is a funny part. And, and if I was that hungry, uh, I don't know how long I would last. I'd rather be dead. <laughs> I like how the music plays with this guy. I, I'm sure Eggman is feeding him. Even he's not that cruel. Okay. <laughs> Let's go and find the professor. I love Chip. He's hilarious. Hey, Grinch, you know, he just said that! Somehow the professor's research threatens Eggman. And if it does, then his notes will probably give us a clue. Here we are. Mysterious hole in Missouri. Mysterious hole. Thank God there's no hot, warm air coming out of it like there is in Pikmin 2. Thank God. Think it on it later. Time to end to Missouri, Sonic. Well, that was quick. Selected. So, I get to go to a new world by doing absolutely nothing. Except watch cutscenes. <laughs> Wow, that was funny. Anyways, village. Actually, I think this would be a great place to end the video off. Next time on Sonic Unleashed, we're going to check out the village. Even though we've already arrived there. See you guys then.